Has Supreme SS18 been the worst collection by the skatewear brand in years? Welcome to Supreme Cop or Drop. I'm your host, Chris from The Soul Supplier, and this is a show where we go through everything that is launching at Supreme this week, and we'll give it a cop if it's hot, and we'll give it a drop if it's a bit dead. So let's start off with these unseen items. We have four t-shirts, we have the swimmers, guns, ridge pocket, and the hardware tee. We can't really judge any of these pieces, but if the Mark Gonzalez tee is anywhere near as good as his previous pieces, it's gonna get a straight cop from me. So we'll give this a little tentative cop. So let's move on to the shirts and the polos. First off, we have that bridal print polo. Coming in three different colorways, it's gonna get a drop from me. I recently went to Marrakesh and the print kind of reminds me of like the walls and the ceilings. It looks penguin on a building, not on a polo. Straight drop. Next up, we have the Vibrations Rayon shirt. Coming in four colorways, dead. Got some booky pictures all the way over it. Gonna get a straight drop. 2-0 to the drops, but we still have that one tentative cop for the Mark Gonzalez t-shirt. Next up, we have the Mesh Baseball tee, coming in five colorways, including a nice, vibrant orange and camo. Gonna get a drop again. I like the colorways and I actually like the print, but Mesh, Meshington's just not a bit of me. I'm a bit too chubby to be pulling off that Mesh. You can tell I'm quite hairy, like chest hair coming through and shit. It's just not a vibe. Drop. So now moving on to the t-shirts, we have the Mona Lisa tee. Got Mona Lisa here and then it has Supreme just down the side. Gonna get a cop from me. At the moment we've only seen a white version but hopefully there's gonna be plenty of colorways releasing. And then next up we have the Crystals T. Supreme once again here with New York, London and Paris just underneath. Supreme's made up of all different crystals. It's gonna get a cop but it's not my favorite tee that Supreme have released in SS18. Next up we have the Tentacles T. We have an octopus just chilling here and then his little tentacles right supreme. Coming in a white colorway, probably will be more again, but this one's gonna get a drop. Not really a fan of the tentacles, to be honest. And then next up, we have the Ganesh T, using the Hindu God, as well as Supreme's branding, and some Hindi writing underneath. It's not a bit of me again. This one's getting a drop. Supreme's SS18 t-shirt collection hasn't been as good as previous years, and this one's definitely not a cop for me. And then rumoured, we have the Hindu T, once again with a nice graphic print on the front and then Supreme branding. Still gonna get a drop. This one's not a guaranteed launch though, it's only rumoured at the moment. So speculation's there, but it's still gonna get a drop. Been a big week for the drop so far. Next up, we have the Alphabet Walter Short. For me, it's got fuck you written across it. It's not great, it's a, it's a bit, bit too visceral for me. Coming in a nice vibrant colorways though, it's still gonna get a drop. I'm not a fan of this print and it will be featured later on in this episode as well, but for now it's getting a drop. Bit too much swearing to print, it's not needed. It's not needed. Next up, we're moving on to the hats. So we have the Raised Camp logo cap. Just with a nice Supreme box logo across the front. It's just a bog standard hat. Can't really go wrong with it, so I'm gonna give this one a cop. Next up, we have the floral pattern hat. Reminiscent of that Stone Island collaboration that they've done a few years back. This one, it's gonna get a drop. The floral pattern isn't for me. It looked much better on the stony jackets. And then the Supreme logo itself is just a bit dead. It's, it's not like a normal box logo. It's like arched inwards. It's a bit of shit. Drop. And now it's time for my favorite part of the show. As always, the accessories. First up, we have the Alphabet Beach Towel. Once again, using that Alphabet print all the way over it. Has fuck you subtly on it. How subtle can you be with a fuck you? But let's be honest, it's gonna get a drop just because that print is absolutely dead. And then next up, we have the Skull Pile Denim Tote. I promise I'm not normally this negative, but this print as well, like from week one, I hated it. It's just so dead. So this one's getting a drop as well. But then finally, we have that piece of the week, the Supreme Backtrack Breathalyzer. Not condoning drink driving, never will do, but this one's getting a cop. So if you've had a couple on a night out and you just need to check if you can drive home, just whip out your little Supreme Breathalyzer, give it a little, you Gucci. This one's getting a cop. But as you can see, this has been a bad week for Supreme. As I said at the beginning of the video, this could be one of the worst collections in a very long while. The drops have outweighed the cops by an absolute mile this week. But let us know in the comments below what you're hoping to cop and drop this week. And make sure you hit that like, share and subscribe button down below and hit the little bell so you stay notified. Keep it locked to the Soul Supplier for all of your streetwear needs. See ya.